So to properly pick up your time iron, you always want to hold it in your right hand with your thumb behind the power button. Your thumb is always going to be resting on the side of the iron without any of the lights. And where you have this little curve, this little bevel, that's the curling side. And one thing that's really helpful to make sure that you're always holding your iron properly is whenever you set your iron down, set it down with the curved side on the counter. That's gonna guard your countertop from the heat and then when you go to pick it up, your thumb's automatically behind the power button so you don't even have to think about it. And then when you're curling, you wanna do vertical sections. I prefer to start from the back and work my way forward, but however you find it easiest to get through your whole head of hair, that's totally up to you. But we want you to grab vertical sections, not horizontal sections. So your pieces are gonna be tall, top to bottom, like so. You don't wanna grab them wide front to back. And when you grab that vertical section, we want you to prep the hair forward. You can do that by running it through your fingers or combing it through with a brush to get rid of any snags or snarls. But when all of that hair is laying in the direction that you move with the iron, you get a much smoother curl all the way through and your curl is gonna start a lot higher. So with my iron down on the countertop, I'm going to turn it on, pick it up with my right hand, thumb behind the power button, grab my vertical section, prep my hair forward. I start with the curve, the curling side in towards my head, my thumb's kind of up towards the ceiling. My fingertips are in towards my face. You come up and underneath your piece on the right side. I'm gonna gently close it, turn my iron back, and push towards the mirror like so. There you have your perfect curl.